Hello and welcome back to Vambrace. We are about to talk to the captain of the guard. Yeah, welcome to you. Uh, well, well, that's probably not the thing to say to the guard. Uh, welcome back to, to you as well. What, what do we have here? Oh, some paper. You found a page of the codex. Oh, uh, that's the first one I found. We can. We have some freedom here. Lamu said you you'd come. They're waiting for you. Please proceed. So this is where I need to go in, apparently. But I can also go upstairs. <laughs> they actually have an arrow. It, it's a bit silly, but I suppose they just really want to make it obvious that you can move around. So... It's not really necessary, because when you go in front of it... Never mind that. Okay, let's just go in. <laughs> oh, never mind that. I, I guess... I suppose we are still going into his uh, personal chambers. Oh, something else. Oh, more pieces of paper. Uh, is this really where he wanted me? I, I'm definitely in the barracks, but this is not the war room, right? This is just where the soldiers sleep. Oh, oh, I'm not supposed to go there. We can also run. If you're a little, uh, not as patient as me. But I guess I'm not that patient either. But where this war room? I don't think the guards are gonna tell me. Seems more like the experimenting room. Oh. Oh, this lady who doesn't like me. You wanna lock me up now? Let me be clear, I don't trust you, as far as I can throw you. It looks like I'm the least of your worries around here. I don't know how you got through the frost thaw, but my gut is telling me something is off. You may be in Lanville's good graces, but respect is earned in my books. Good, that makes both of us. I got my eyes on you. What the hell? Why do you hate me so much? Alright, let's go. I'm a little surprised that we managed to one-shot the braid, or whatever that was. So, oh, that's not the war room. Where's the war room? That's, okay. I don't know where the war room is. Is it the war room? This chamber belongs to our leader. Commander... The guard went where true. This is strictly off limits. He has one guard uh, guarding his room. Wow, that's that's a very questionable fashion choice, lady. Uh, I'm I'm all for showing off skin, but really, look at that other guy. Look at him. Look at yourself. Come on, look at that. This is not the time for miniskirt. Do you know where the war room is? No, he doesn't know. Where the war room is? We don't know. <laughs> God damn it. How could I not find the war room? So this is the personal chamber of uh, this lady who doesn't like me. I really need to start learning names. No, this is not it. Why am I so bad at this? Where's the war room? No, no one tells me where the war room is. This <laughs> oh my god. Oh, never mind that. We're good. <laughs> oh. Alright. Screwing around for minutes, trying to find the war room in a tiny, tiny barracks. Hey, what's up? The Guardians are composed of soldiers recruited from across the uh, five realms and three cities of Adara. Our efforts have ushered in a new era of peace over the world. Love the getup. What are you? Yo, seems like these guys just have like a generic... Oh, never mind that. This guy had more to say, but I kind of skipped it. But they usually have uh, less to say. Oh, this is the city map. Looks like uh, the Guardians have uh, profiled the most important people of the city. Alright. Loving the miniskirts. Uh, how the hell do you guys keep warm? The ne a new frost fence has cut off access to the supplies of any that goes bizarre. The situation is dire. You're still trying this on what? Trying this under wraps? More like tying? Still a little. Never mind that. <laughs> oh, this is what. Oh my god, look at that haircut. Yes. <clears throat> I don't know how it happened, sir, but we're making every effort. Oh, that's his boss. 
Lyric, uh, glad you could join us. I'd like to introduce you to our esteemed leader, uh, Vagard Bentru. Wow, really? It's the guy I was looking for. Very stylish. What the hell? Vagard? I set out in a search of you months ago. I can hardly believe you're standing here now. Oh, please excuse me. Apologies for interrupting. I'm just pleased to make you your acquaintance, sir. Hmm. Please, call me Zagard. The captain just informed me of your unusual arrival. I have a lot of questions, but they have to wait. Yes, sorry to cut this introduction short, but we have an ongoing situ oh, no. situation. Isabel Salazar escaped her cell and left the Ark. Really? How the hell? Maybe you shouldn't have like 10 guards gr gu guarding your personal chamber. She murdered our guards and allowed a dead man, dead, uh, uh, mad wraith into the Ark, putting many lives at risk. But I just saw her, briefly, while having my paperwork done. She even spoke to me as I was leaving. I guess that was like some time ago still. What? She hasn't spoken in a year! Do you remember what she said? Ah, uh, <laughs> Nope, no idea. I didn't pay, <clears throat> I didn't pay uh, much heat to her at the time. Who is she? That which is uh, one of the Shade King's prime lieutenants. If she gets away, she will compromise Delark's location. If that happens, nothing will save us. Then forgive me for asking, but why aren't you pursuing her right now? We tried. We were unable to follow her through the frost uh, fence, though. To use her magic to bypass it. Frost fence? They are smaller barriers conjured from the same magic as Frostfell. The green flame uses them to limit our access to certain sectors of uh, Ice Snare. They too are deadly to the touch. But that wouldn't be an issue for you, right? Would it, Lyric? Sir? It's true, I walk through Frostfell. I could do so through the power of uh, this Vambrace, but you already knew that, didn't you? How did you come into the possession of this artifact? <clears throat> My late father left it to me. His final letter bid me to seek you out in this cursed place. This Vambrace, he said, was the key to coming here. It allowed me to bypass the Frostfell harmlessly. Would your father happen to be the esteemed Dr. Nicolao Lyric? One and the same. How could you possibly know that? The same name. He's a renowned scholar, and his research on the Archons is unsurpassed. I am well versed on his works. Now, before he stands a woman bearing his namesake and carrying a relic of Arconic design, even I can connect the do dots. You can rec you recognize this thing? It's called the Etherbrace. Powerful relic indeed. I'm not sure Lyric realizes the value of, of what she possesses. If all you say is true, then she should give it to us. We could use it to turn to tide against the King of Shades. It's not that simple. I can remove it. I've tried everything short of cutting off my arm. Wait, what? You have a bracer that's so attached to your arm? Uh, you know, you're just giving these guards ideas. Did, did you see them? Like, they're not exactly uh, solving problem with, uh, problems with wits. So they definitely wouldn't shy away, some, away from some brute force. Lyric, you, you seek answers, and I'm willing to help you. But our priority now is finding Isabel. Would you be willing to lead a party past the frost fence to find her? I lead the party? Um... I'm not sure what gave you that idea, other than my ability to uh, walk through it. I'm not particularly uh, qualified, I suppose. <clears throat> this is my first tracking mission. I'll help, but when I 
Come back, we we'll need to talk. Uh, you'll need uh, a place to prepare before deploying. Take the scroll of consent and tell Helga at the Lost Lady Inn I sent you. She'll make sure you have a space. My scouts inform me Isabel was moving north toward the entertainment district. We will send some guardians with you to the surface to help. Of course. <clears throat> if you're looking for cell swords, you might have some uh, luck at the recruitment board. In the meantime, I'll make sure the ascending room is set for your next destination. Leave it to me. Okay, I guess th this is the time when the the town opened up to us. So now we can maybe make some... Oh, look at that. Older fox, man. Hey, girl. Over here. Uh... I'm pretty busy right now. Then I'll keep it brief. I am Maru Han, the acting director of North Venture Company in Dockenheim. It feels more natural to say Dockenheim than Dockheim. I heard rumor. I heard rumor. Yeah. Yeah. I might need to correct the grammar at... I might just correct the grammar in places where I feel appropriate. I heard a rumor Lanville was assembling an expedition to the entertainment district. Is that true? Not like I have great gam grammar. <laughs> just... Um, word travels fast around here. There are a few activities uh, to while away the hours in Delark, and the gift of the gab has always been my specialty. Well, your sources were right, but the original expedition was cancelled and I'm leading the, the new one by myself. Then I have a special request. There's an item of great importance to me in the, in the entertainment district. The merchant, Manduk, is currently in possession of it. What is this item, and who is Manduk? The golden seal called the Oxe. It is granted by the Asadali Emperor and confers legitimacy to its owner to conduct business on behalf of the North Venture Company in Dockheim. Manduk was the company's former chief. This doesn't seem like something worth risking our lives over. Risk brings reward. Fetch me the seal, and I'll ensure you get the finest deals in Delark. You'll need my help if you're planning regular expeditions to the surface. <clears throat> Alright, I'll keep an eye out for it, but I'm not making any promises. Smart girl. The merchant's fate has already been sealed. It is our little use. It is of little use. To her now, but it is priceless to me. I'll be seeing you around. All right, we're getting some missions, very promising. So let's just go around town and uh, oh, this is where we're supposed to go, I suppose. Uh, yes, the inn, I guess. Lost Lady Inn. Oh, we can't go in there. Hey, foxes, what's up? Tonight, this just isn't your night, my friend. What are you talking about? Just deal the cards! Ah. Oh, this is a pretty big one. Oh, maybe she's a dwarf? Kind of. Very big dwarf, but she seems very thick. Are you Helga? Oh. Wow. Well, look. I don't know. I have no idea what kind of voice should I give her. Also, I'm kind of losing track of the voice that I already gave to people. Well, look. What the snow cat dragged in. I heard there was a new face in town. My name is Lyric. Zangart sends his regards. He said you could uh, set me up with a room here. That's so. Hmm. Unfortunately, we're full up. Oh. Actually, I might have something for you, but it can hardly be called a room. Uh, you used to roughing it? I had my fair share of nights uh, without a roof over my head. Then you won't have any problems here. We have a space behind the bar that's being used for storage. You can unload over there. Uh, what? Space behind the bar? 
Um, at least I wanted, like, you know, just some privacy? Thanks. I'm not complaining. <laughs> Holy crap. I guess we're not. Make yourself at home and feel free to spruce it up. What? Sleeping behind the bar? Alright. Sure. I hope it's it's better than she made it sound. Ooh, we found another page. I'm not sure where we took it from. Oh, dwarf. Uh drinking with a fox. <clears throat> fox ear. <laughs> Rumor has it that Poxier Mahoram just settled into the Lost Lady. He's uh, been keeping a pretty low profile past year. Oh, Red Fox. Thief extraordinaire? Yeah, right. I swear you Foxier will believe every rumor in the street. It's true. Well, I haven't seen him by mys uh, myself, but a friend uh, from the market mentioned that, and his word is as good as gold. The day I believe that is the day I shave my beard. Alright. What do we have here? Prostitute! Oh my god. Can we uh, acquire your services? Watch your snap. Wouldn't want to trip down the stairs and bust that pretty hand of yours. Hmm. It wasn't as sweet as I made her sound like. Now let's just go down. Oh! Maybe we're just gonna have some privacy over anyway. Hey. Don't look, but the lady in red is back again. Huh. Some say that is the one and only Charlotte Lorelei. Princess Lorelei? What is she doing in the place like this? Maybe I should make a move. Huh. Like royalty would want anything to do with your flea bitten ass. Alright. Interesting banter between the characters. With the announcements, dearest patrons of the Lost Lady Pub and Inn, it has come to my attention that many of you have been leaving empty mugs and bottles uh, strewn about the premises. Just because it's the apocalypse doesn't mean we have to act like beasts. Please do your part in keeping the Lost Lady clean. That's very reasonable. Oh, maybe another prostitute? Can't go in there. I like the, I like that it's not in English. I know this, or yeah, I of course I have English as the selected language, but it's not in English, and I like that. <clears throat> Makes it seems more mysterious and special. Ultimately, I don't need to necessarily read that. <clears throat> I sense the presence of fellow adventurous. Kind of has my voice now. <clears throat> That's quite the sixth sense you have there. The name's lyric. Who might you be? No offense, but I'm not looking for new friends. They always end up six feet under. That's a jaded outlook. Survive a few trips to the surface and maybe we'll have something in common. Until then, keep your guard up. Okay, so... Maybe this is a... Uh... Oh. I should know that this is not uh, my room. It's, uh, yeah. Anyway, but um, maybe she was gonna join us later. I guess that's what the indication there. Oh. I guess my room is not here. Do I even have a room? No. So, okay. I'll just go upstairs. Those areas are a little odd. May, may seem a little odd. But they're actually quite sensible. Can I just... Oh, maybe that's, this is my place. Oh, yeah. This is it? This is lovely! I love it! Wow, she wasn't kidding! This place is a dump! Hey, you take what you can get. Nah. This is not, not bad, actually. I thought I was just gonna uh, sleep behind the bar, but this is awesome! I do like the art. <clears throat> well, if I'm gonna stay here, I might as well. Clean it up a bit. Yeah, that's, that's reasonable. Oh, I'm gonna do it? Right now? Ah, oh, that's great! It took all night to clean that mess. 
Yeah, but if you plan to stay here long term, it's just gonna be a gift that keeps keeps on giving. I have to admit, this place looks a lot better now. It's really not half bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. this looks really good. She definitely undersold it. I even have my own fireplace. That's crazy. It's about time to head out. I should check the recruitment board, Lambo mentioned, to see if I can find some more, uh, some more hands for the expedition. Oh yeah, we definitely need some guys. But how am I gonna pay for that? I can keep my clothes in the closet. I could really use a fresh change. Can I change it now? Oh, Lyric can change her clothes in the dressing room. You will unlock new skins as you progress through your expedition. Cool! CVs! Oh. I don't know, I kind of like this. Obviously this is a single player game, but... I, I suppose this is just completely... Uh, cosmetic. But this is an extra customization. That's just not, that's just a lovely touch. So this is not something that ever gonna be like, oh, I don't like this. You know, it, this is always can can only be a plus. I just go with this. Yes, yes, you should wear that. Yes, looks good. I don't think you have a. I don't think she's gonna have a single uh, poor choice of clothing. Oh yeah, let's just sleep. It has been a while since I slept in a proper bed. Looks like it's about to fall apart. But I'd rather take my chances than sleep on the cold, stony ground. You have a proper bed! Sleepy, sleepy. Yes, sleepy. Yeah, you should definitely sleep before you head out. Like, Your progress has been saved. I feel rested. Looking at the flame relaxes me. This fireplace really brings some welcome warmth to my stay here. Hmm, what else do we have here? Oh, this is my storage unit. I can keep my stuff in here. This space is, uh... The space in my pack is limited, and my companions won't be able to bring much either. Oh, that's cool. If I carry too much, I won't be able to continue the expedition to the best of my ability. She means we won't be able to get the loot back home. Okay. Alright, we can store stuff here. You can access the items you've stored uh, from... yeah... shop, market. No, oh, that's cool. Okay, well, we have nothing, so... We don't have to worry about it. A bath with running water? Impressive! The ancient aqueduct system here is more advanced than most in modern cities. Hmm. Wait, I can actually take a bath? Well... Alright, this is really nice. This is huge. This is a huge place. Alright, that that woman. Holy crap! You're just giving that away. A door, well, I mean a, a room by the the front door. That's huge. Comes with its own fireplace, and you're just giving away like it's trash. Are you crazy? I mean, uh, this 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 will do. Anyway, uh, let's go. Cool. And uh, try to find the next step. Finding some uh, friends and adventures to come with us. But let's just take a break. Thanks for watching, guys, and see you next time.